Alright, so today I'm going to show you this new invincibility glitch on zombies. It's basically involving this trap right here, and you can land on top of this thing, and zombies actually can't get to you when you're stood on top of it. So what you're going to need to do first is activate all three valves, and I'll show you the locations now. If you don't know where they are, or you're new to the game, or you do know where they are and you can skip to the actual glitch. So you need all three of these to activate the trap, and um, that's the first one done. Second one's over here. They do take a long time to turn on, so be careful you don't die whilst you're doing this if you're playing solo. And I think only one person can actually use this glitch. I don't think more than one person can actually fit on that little thing there. You might be able to if you squeeze them on, but you have to position yourself perfectly, otherwise you will get slapped and die. So be careful of that. Alright, so the third valve is just here. I'll show you exactly where it is in a second. So it's just up these steps. You can actually come from spawn. So the gate from spawn is just there. You need power to do so. And you actually just come out of spawn there. Turn left and the valve is down there, you just saw. So now all three valves are turned on, you will be able to activate the trap. And you're gonna have to activate the trap first to destroy these little barricades. And zombies will come out of here. So make sure you have a gun or something to defend yourself with. Zombies come out. Kill them. My pistol, because I don't have any of the guns. And there you can see, zombies are dead. And now the little barricade things at the side have gone. So you can jump on there if you want to. But you need to turn on the little valve down there to get out. So you usually don't want to go down there. Right, so the type is right here. And I, I usually buy the type and then just use the trap because in between rounds you can just go and get ammo and then jump back onto the trap to prepare for the next round. Alright, so you need 500 jolts to actually use the trap, so if you fail it's going to cost quite a lot and it takes about 10 seconds to reset the trap anyway, so it can cost to actually use this if you don't get it right first time. Alright, so I have 500 jolts now and I can actually use the trap and you have to get your positioning perfect really to land on this because it can the trap can actually like throw you quite far up into the air and you can overshoot it really easily so you just want to you don't, you don't want to overshoot you don't want to move like fully to the left because right I'm, I'm just going to show you so activate it hop down here as you can see that I missed it because it, it's super hard to not overshoot it and it will take about 10 seconds to reset and then it costs another 500 jolts Alright, so now I'm on top of the trap and you can't get hit from this position basically, but you have to position yourself perfectly. It may take a few tries to get it right, but especially if there's zombies around you and you're trying to do it, then it will not work because you'll just die and they'll just slap you. So try and do it in between rounds, like now try and get on top of it. But anyway, if you just stay in the right position, usually on these two barrels, just switch between them. If the zombies will come either this side or this one, if they're that side, just swap and then swap and keep training them like that. And you can get so much XP in this pile of glitch. So yeah, if you like the video, leave a like, comment if you enjoyed the video, subscribe if you're new to my channel, and peace.